Watch this video to learn a few tips and tricks to guide you as you grade student work within JT Learn submission libraries. After students have submitted their work, you are now ready to go ahead and grade within your submission libraries. Go ahead and open your submission library. Note that the approval status column should say pending. This means that students only see their work, not everyone in the class. Notice this folder says approved, and that's because I want all students to see the folder. But the individual assignments just say pending. If you have a group of student files you'd like to grade, it is easiest to open them all at once by going to Library in the top, and then Open with Explorer. From here, you can check mark all the files you'd like to open at once. Go ahead and right click and click Open. This is similar to having a large stack of papers in front of you to grade at once. Once you are in a document, notice the Save Disk in the left corner. It has a circular arrow on it. This signifies it will save back to JT Learn. You can go ahead and make comments on the student work by placing your cursor where you'd like to comment, right-clicking, and writing New Comment. You can go ahead and type your comment, and before you're all done, be sure to save it. It will then save back to JT Learn. You can close out. And when you go back to JT Learn, the changes will be there. Now when students go back to open their document, they will see the comments you made and be able to edit appropriately. Thanks for viewing.